well, I thought we played well enough to win again. I mean, we got in, we did everything right inside the final third, which we hadn't been. We got more shots off, um, more fluidity in the final third, and keeper makes a big save. I mean, you know, I thought we played well enough. Um, defensively, I thought even against the win and with some questionable calls, which meant big balls coming into the box, we were very um, sound and, and together and strong. So I'm, I'm real proud of their efforts. You know, they, they bent, but they didn't break tonight, and that's a good thing. We weren't able to find the back of the net tonight, <laughs> but you were able to keep the opponent shut out here at home. Yeah. Uh, have you seen an improvement from the defense, or how were you able to get the shutout out today? Well, I mean, I think we put much, so much pressure on them. They didn't really get good looks at the goal. Um, again, when we went against the wind, they, they had some outside opportunities that were a little bit scary just because anywhere you hit them, the, the wind was carrying it. But I mean, I think other than that, we just we stayed with the game plan and we played very good soccer at times. Um, it got a little physical and that's a little unfortunate, but I, I think we just stayed by the game plan and did a good job. What do you have to do to get the ball to bounce your way? Just keep staying, you know, instead of thinking, oh, we got to try something different. Just keep, keep staying on task. There's, I mean, I got a lot of young kids in today. A lot. Katie Hinman's best minutes for us probably um, not just all year, but in her two years, including last spring, she played very, very well. So got a lot of young kids on the field, rotated some out of the back because we needed to. And um, I think we just stay on task. It's going to come.